An Ancaster athlete is making waves in an unusual profession, and you may have seen some of his skills already if you've taken in a Hamilton Tiger Cats game this season. We introduce you to Corey Field, a mascot on the rise. An Ancaster athlete is moving up the ranks as one of North America's youngest professional mascots. 20-year-old Corey Field first put his college's mascot costume on as sort of a dare. She went to a basketball game one time and one of my friends said, oh, why don't you become the school mascot? And I thought it was pretty funny, but as a joke, I went up to the athletic director and he said, yeah, we'll, we'll have you as the mascot. And I thought I would do a few games, but he wanted me for the full two years. And from there, his mascot career took off. Well, it's a little different. You have to have the outgoing personality. You have to be crazy. He was on a baseball scholarship in Utica, New York, and enrolled in the school's theater program. His flair for dramatics led to him winning a local mascot popularity contest. And then a few uh, weeks later, I was actually in the gym with my buddies, and I got a call from a New Jersey number, and it was the New Jersey Devils calling me, saying, oh, we have a game in an hour for our minor league team. Uh, we'll pick you up in 10 minutes. And I think that's where everything really started. And he just signed a seven month contract to be Naughty, the Utica Comets mascot, the New Jersey Devils farm team. And Field is also one of the mascots for the Hamilton Tiger Cats. Yes, I'm Stripes. I was Stripes at the beginning of the season, shifted towards TC, but I do uh, most some games and um, events and stuff around, which is pretty cool. Field was asked to perform for the Boston Red Sox this summer, but couldn't because he was playing for the Brantford Red Sox. But going forward, he says baseball will take a backseat to mascotting because he has one goal in mind. Honestly, early retirement. <laughs> and, <laughs> and mascotting is a very good way to take that. Um, there's not, I don't think there's one mascot in the NHL that's making under triple digits. In fact, some NBA mascots make more than $600,000 a year. But Field says it's a lot of hard work. I don't want people thinking you're walking up and down the aisle waving your hand, right? Like it, there is way more to mascotting. Um, there's not a game where you probably like you won't be sick afterwards. Or for example, it's a strain on your body and you do have to be an athlete and have those tricks. And because if the uh, fans aren't entertained, then you're not doing your job correctly. And Field says like in professional sports, if you're not good enough, the team will replace you.